United Therapeutics is a uh, biopharmaceutical company that kind of specializes in lung diseases. They've been developing cures for these diseases uh, over time, but one of their guiding principles is they have no business saving people's lives if they're also going to kind of ruin the world environmentally while doing so. So they have this large initiative uh, to, to have every facility that they build to be net zero, uh, meaning that they produce as much energy as they consume. AGT has been fortunate enough now to have completed three projects for the United Therapeutics Organization uh, from Melbourne up to Satellite Beach and now into Jacksonville at the Mayo Clinic campus for their new LB2 facility where they're producing as much renewable energy as they're consuming over the course of a year. We really had a, a pretty big coordination effort to, to get this thing from concept into completed and final design. Really the, the biggest issue at, uh, at the project was not only a time constraint, but it was as much of a space constraint as time. So uh, when we're talking about the Mayo Clinic campus, we're talking about uh, tens of thousands of visitors a day. Uh, parking is, is a premium around the campus. And so when we're taking out of uh, service over 300 parking spaces, that becomes a, a big topic with management at the campus uh, who ultimately we're reporting to. So when you're, when you're talking about doing that, there's obvious a push to get those back into service for all the people that are coming in and out of the property. Nothing that we weren't able to meet, it was just something that was always on top of mind to get people back into parking spaces and back underneath the carport. Aesthetically, it's a beautiful project. The, uh, the radius component, the architectural components of the steel fabrication that, uh, that we integrated into the project really bring an aesthetic level uh, to the power production point, which is you know, taking a facility to net zero is a rarity at this scale. Uh, but to do it while integrating architectural features into the project so you not only have a beautiful project, you have a functional project, you have a project that's designed to last for 25, 30 years uh, and deliver energy over that period of time, uh, we really feel like it's a next level project.